Welcome to the homework for lesson 14. This is module 7 of grade 3. Get your name on first so you don't turn in homework with no name on it. And it says label the unknown side lengths of the regular shapes below and then find the perimeter of each shape. Now we're not actually measuring the sides of these shapes. It says right here that these are regular shapes which means that all the sides are equal. So it, if it says what one is then we know what the rest of them are because they're all the same. But we have to label them anyway and then write down what the perimeter is of each shape. So here's this equilateral triangle. If that's, this side here is four inches and this side here also four inches and this one also four inches and three fourths is twelve for twelve inches. And the square for B, this side here is eight centimeters so that means all the sides are 8 centimeters and 8 times 4 32 and now we have a regular octagon and all the sides are 9 meters And eight nines is 72 meters. And here we have a regular hexagon with six inch sides. And six sixes is 36. Then label the unknown side lengths of this rectangle below and find the perimeter of the rectangle. So we know opposite sides are equal. So if this side here is four, then this side here also has to be four centimeters. All parallelograms are like that. And all rectangles are parallelograms. So we have uh, two, nine plus four is 13. And so we have two 13s to add together. Mentally, that's 26. So we, we could write all that down. Twenty-six centimeters. Roxanne draws a regular pentagon and labels a side length as shown below find the perimeter of Roxanne's pentagon. So it's a regular pentagon, so all the sides are 7 cm. There's five of them, so it's five sevens. And five sevens is 35. as a perimeter of 35 centimeters. Each side of a square measures 24 meters. So there isn't a picture here, so you better draw one. What is the perimeter of the field? So we're going to add we're going to add all these twenty fours together. Uh, that's something you, you you could do in your head, but you really should write this down somehow to show how you did it mentally. So you could just do this all vertically. like that and then you're just looking at four fours for 16 and four twos is eight and one more is nine 96 uh, you might have been you might have seen that 96 coming 
if you did it mentally too, there's other ways you could do this. You could see these as 48s, like this, and then mentally add the 48s, or kind of the same way. You could think of um, 812s. You could do it that way too. Whatever works best for you. Um, so now we need, a, need an answer here. We're having so much fun with the math. We've got to write down our answer. What is the perimeter of the field? The perimeter and, you, and probably somebody's going to have a better way of doing it than I thought of. Maybe a lot of people will. The perimeter of the field is 96 meters. What's the perimeter of a rectangular sheet of paper that measures 8 by 11 inches? So draw the rectangle, label it, Eight plus eight plus eleven plus eleven. Okay, so that's uh, sixteen and twenty-two. Or you could think of two nineteens, which would be thirty-eight. 